Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel. And if you are using Microsoft Edge, and even if you're not, we had, of course, security updates for Google Chrome this week. And the security updates, well, we also knew that they were coming to all Chromium-based browsers. Uh, that's why we always say, you know, look at your updates if you're using uh, Opera or Brave or Edge. Uh, they are, of course, always uh, updating with the same security updates since they're Chromium-based. So Edge added its update. If you go into the upper right corner, the three horizontal dots, help and feedback about Microsoft Edge, and you will be updated to version 114.0.1823.51. So this is the latest version for the Microsoft Edge browser. It contains all the security fixes, including the critical one that was uh, announced by uh, Google for the Google Chrome browser. So how bad that is, we have no idea because they're not really giving us much information. But um, this is important to apply. I always say, you know, even if you don't use Edge, take the time to update it because this will definitely uh, help you out. Uh, it's sometimes, you know, you click a link and you know how sometimes Edge is kind of popping up for some reason um, by clicking a link or, or you know, whatever. Uh, so by having it um, updated, it's um, going to stay safe. It uh, doesn't update necessarily for those that never, never use it as the service might not be running. So uh, just make sure that you're at the latest version so that you stay safe, uh, especially with all the um, security flaws. And, you know, if you do get into Edge, well, at least it's the your first line of defense is the security updates of the browser. And if you use Edge, well, of course, it, uh, it should technically update itself automatically. But if uh, you want to make sure, you can check out if you have the latest security updates that were released this week, as we are today, June 16th, 2023. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.